Yes! <laughs> yes! Man! The 5 0! Boom! <laughs> What's up, everyone? Toy Tactical here. Today, I'll be showing you how I reached rank 10 in Season 4 of Go Battle League. I managed to hit it this, uh, this Tuesday, the 20th. And I started the day at 28.35 rating, so I really wasn't expected to hit it. But I went on an insane run, went 21 in 4 on the day, and managed to hit 30.43 rating at the end of it, which I was pretty stoked about. I really wasn't expecting it, but somehow managed to do it. I, uh, I ran a team of Hexorus, Metagross, and Gyarados for the entirety of the run, uh, with uh, Counter, Night Slash, and Dragon Claw on the Hexorus, Bullet Punch, Meteor Mass, and Earthquake on a Metagross, and Dragon Breath, Aqua Tail, and Crunch on the Gyarados. I did my first three sets off stream, so I'll be uh, shoutcasting some of my uh, best battles from those three, first three sets uh, right now. And after that, I'll be, uh, I'll be showcasing some of my best battles from the stream. And I'll also show the entirety of, me fi of my final set because it was pretty hype. And you really want to stick around to the end, uh, because uh, my final match, I, I go with Ludicolo in Masters Premiere, and it's a pretty epic battle, so you definitely uh, definitely don't want to miss out on that. So, you know, let's just re hide right into the shoutcast of the first three sets. Alright, so first game, Hexers hit the Swamper. This is a pretty good lead matchup. Uh, Exhaust and Gyarados, I don't really have a great answer to Gyarados in the back, except for my own Gyarados. So I, uh, I throw Dragon Claw here to, to uh, take out some health, and now my Gyarados can safely come in and, and take switch advantage, which is really important right here. I don't want my Metagross uh, uh, lined up against his Swampert. So I really I really do want to maintain switch advantage here. I go for the Aqua Tail right before he can get to one, uh, take him out. And pretty sure he comes in with the Magnezone right here. Yeah, there we see the Magnezone, which can fire me down. And this is quite dangerous. A wild charge from Magnezone onto Hexorus still does quite a quite a bit of damage. So I have to uh, I have to be careful uh, careful with that. Farms me down. I think I come in with uh, I should probably come in with Metagross right here. I don't want my Metagross lined up against the Swampert, so I can just take some energy here. And after he debuffs himself, I can even choose to come in with Hexorus to, uh, to farm him down, which I do. Look at that, one counter took like 10% of his, his health. I was expecting the mirror shot right there, but he threw the wild charge, which as you can see, did a ton of damage. Luckily, much shot doesn't do that much from Swampert, but it still does, it still add up, adds up. So he's likely gonna be able to farm it down here. Decides to throw a move. It's a good play. I mean, he will take a shield. I'm just looking to uh, to get him into meter mesh range right here, actually. So throw a drag low. Likely gonna see a shield. We do see a shield, and right there, I just counter him down. And he's currently in meter mesh range, so hopefully I can get there. I need to over farm though. I really need to over farm. Uh, I know he's three away, so one, two, three. CMP tied to the meter mesh, and then the Magnezone is six away from another wild charge. So well, hopefully we we'll get it. Two, three, four, five. Yeah, get it right before he gets to uh, gets the wild charge. So the over over farm there was was very critical. Good game to my opponent, making it so close with uh, with a pretty bad lead for him. So uh, well played. All right, Hexorus in Tokyo is just not what you want to see. Luckily, I didn't see many of these uh, uh, yesterday, but I did see a couple. Luckily, I was able to win all of them. But uh, they were like really close matchups, and I did get a get a bit lucky with uh, with the back lines or uh, or with the way my opponent played. He swaps his uh, guard chomp into my uh, Gyarados, which is pretty uh, strange because uh, Gyarados does win this matchup. But it kind of makes sense because Hexorus has a decent matchup against guard chomp, so I guess he just wanted to get some use out of it. Uh, I just really want to win switch right here because uh, I don't want my extras lined up against that Tokus. We do get switch, he goes into Tokus. I bring in my Metagross, and well, he brings in Magnezone, I bring in Hexorus, and that's game over right there. He concedes, so I think a bit of a misplay by my opponent there. Should've just brought in his, uh, his Magnezone against my Gyarados, but it happens. So anyway, next game, Gyarados into Hexorus, just not what you wanna see. 
again, I don't have great matchup as, uh, matchups against, against Gyarados. I, uh, I just gotta use my own Gyarados right here. He goes into Shadow Magnezone, which is like really bad for me. Uh, at this point, I'm actually expecting double steel as well. So I'm gonna play it accordingly. Uh, and if, I, if I'm expecting double steel, I really need to save shields uh, for uh, my Axorus or my Metagross. And I don't want to get into a sh uh, shoot disadvantage because in a shoot disadvantage, Met Metagross just kills my whole backline. Uh, I burn a shoot there, which is very nice. Again, if it's double steel, I, I am in an all right spot here. I take this wild charge, uh, which you will see does quite a lot. Oh, it's actually a mirror shot. That's actually a pretty good call. No debuff, please. All right, he swaps out into his Gyarados. I go into Metagross and I shoot his move right here. I was expecting a crunch. Most people don't bait right here, but he actually baits me, so good play on his part. At this point, I'm just hoping I farm down. Throws another crunch. This time we do shoot a crunch. Very nice. And I tried to go for the move here. I wanted to throw before he got to a crunch, but he actually he threw an aqua tail, which doesn't do that much. That's fine. I could just continue farming down right here, and that's my only play at this point. I kind of, I'm kind of hoping he has a metagross in the back. And I can maybe uh, double meteor mesh it, and then hit it with uh, uh, with a night slash to kill. But that last aqua tail really hurts me. It puts me really low. So even if it was a metagross, I'd be in a tough spot. But it ends up being a snorlax, and snorlax is just way too tanky. Uh, one meteor mesh and a dragon claw is unfortunately not enough to uh, to take this uh, fat guy out. So so tanky. It's a best buddy as well. Which uh, makes it just a tiny, tiny more uh, tanky. Didn't matter here, but uh, still, props to my opponent for having a best buddy Snorlax. So, good game right there. That was my first loss of the day. Alright, Hex versus the Magnezone. Really, really good matchup for me. But you're gonna see my opponent plays really well here. He swaps into Conkelder, which is a problem for my team because Stone Edge pretty much one shots uh, Gyarados. And with an energy lead, uh, it also wins against Metagross. So I just swap it to my Gyarados right there, but as I said, Stone Edge will one shot, so I will have to uh, I will have to shield it up, uh, over farm here just a tad, throw the Aqua Tail right right before he gets to another another Stone Edge. Uh, I think I think he doesn't no he doesn't shield right here. Good for me, uh, but he brings in the Magnezone right here and can just farm me down, which is uh, quite bad because again a Wild Charge does quite a lot of damage against Haxorus. Uh, my Metagross doesn't appreciate them as well. I'll go for double Aqua Tail. At this point, he's so low, I think I can just farm down with one counter, but he expects it. He, he, he swaps out before I can get a single counter through. So, well played on his part. Anticipating my swap with the Hexorus, that's like really well played. And now I'm actually in a tough spot because he, he's, he's got a Wild Charge banked in the back, uh, which my Metagross won't enjoy. And this uh, Dragonite has a ton of energy. It's gonna take this move. Uh, if it's Draco, it does more than a wild charge, but anything else does less than a than a wild charge uh, does. It throws a hurricane, which does like quite a bit of damage. I'm just hoping I can uh, I can kill him right here, but I'm gonna have to expand a shield, which is a problem. Uh, but I'm gonna explain my my mindset here real quick. As you see, the switch timer is up. The switch timer is up, and I'm thinking. Uh, we swapped at the same time, so his switch timer is up as well. He just took my final shield. He has a Magnezone in the back with a move. So I'm expecting him to swap right here and throw the move immediately. That's what we call a combo move. It's a pretty common play. It pretty much uh, it, it allows the opponent to, to, to burn a shield and then kill my Magnezone, Mag Ma uh, Metagross like right after it. But I expect it and I and I make the hard call to, uh, to hard swap into a uh, into Gyarados. Let's see if it uh, pays off, and it does. I ca catch the the wild charge on my uh, on my Gyarados, which uh, pretty much like seals the deal for me. I can just farm this down now. Hopefully, get to another medium mesh against the Dragonite. I do. Very close game. Like very well played by my opponent as well. Almost coming back from such a bad lead. So uh, props to him. GGs. All right. Next game. We got Haxorus and Tokus. No, you what? Not what you want to see. This time my opponent stays in, which is not great. I can I can only get to two Aqua Tails here. 
actually swaps out into his Waterfall Gyarados, which is not bad. Uh, Metagross does not like to see Waterfall Gyarados, so I'm glad to get it out of the way. I still shoot one of my crunches here, because uh, otherwise he will lose Switch Advantage. He can probably just farm me down right here. I'm gonna shield this because I want both of his shields out of the way. Metagross with shields down is just so strong, so that's my play here. I'm expecting maybe a triple flyer line. And if it's triple flyer, it would be uh, Dragonite in the back. And in that case, uh, Metagross just gonna clean up. I decided to no shield right here, expecting an Outrage actually. Uh, which would almost kill, but that's fine with me. He actually throws an Aqua Tail, which is even better. I decide to go into my Metagross, hopefully get a bit more energy. Actually, has a Guard Chomp in the back, which is not great. Uh, but with a Shield Advantage, Metagross can definitely deal with this. He only threw uh, five Mud Shots, which is only enough for uh, Sand Tomb. No need to shield that, because the second one would do more damage, because of the defense debuff I got. Throw the Meteor Mash. And... Uh, well, I'm gonna shoot this one up because that one would almost KO me. Uh, I can get, I can farm down this guard shop now and uh, throw the meteor mesh on the tokens, and uh, that seals the deal for uh, for this game. So yeah, GG's to my opponent. As you can see, tokens leads are quite tough to deal with. I got a bit lucky here with uh, with the way my opponent played it, um, but it's definitely uh, definitely manageable. As you can as you can see so anyway these were my uh, best best battles for my first three sets i went 13 and 15 in these sets it brought me all the way up to 2970 from 2835 and after that i was like yeah 30 points more is not too much to ask for right so let's just turn on the stream let's see what happens hopefully reach reach rank 10 that'd be pretty hype and uh, yeah let's just uh, head into the clips right now make sure to uh, to stay into the end because there's an epic Ludicolo battle coming and you definitely don't want to miss out on that. So uh, enjoy. What's up? Alright guys. I had a pretty rough day so I wasn't feeling like streaming. Um, but I took some time to relax and I did three sets and I went 504141. So you know I got a, a bit happier. Uh, and now I'm at 2970 and I have two sets left. So, yeah, I might make it today, but uh, we'll see. All right. Cry Suvik. Bring it. D Knight, all right. I hate this. I just swap to uh, Gyarados. Hmm. I'll no shield a drink rule. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Uh, what would he have in the back? Could be anything, really. Dragonite, Snorlax, it's it's likely a steal. Definitely, yeah, probably Metagross. Which, like, wouldn't be too bad. If I can get, like, a... Uh, uh, shield advantage. I'm gonna farm down right here. This is just a body slam. Yeah, Steve-O, that, that was really unfortunate. That lag. That was, I'm sorry, buddy. I wasn't sure if you were lagging too. All right. What's he coming with? I mean, she's gonna have to shoot this. Oh, no shield? Oh, no. All right. Simultaneous swap. This is just gonna depend on who gets this fast move through or not. But anyway, in the two shields, you just go straight meter mesh.
All right. Oh, I wasn't even at Earthquake, that's dumb. <laughs> but it doesn't matter, you're still straight, straight meter mesh anyway. Oh, she only went meter mesh as well. Alright, fine. Hmm. Whoa, no shield? Can I farm this down? Yeah, I can. Interesting play. Interesting move. Um, I think uh, she might have thought my Hexorus was... Alright, well played. Well played. <laughs> I lost anyway, so well played. Oh, that simultaneous swap was unfortunate. Alright, let's see. Still two games to set. Alright. Hexus, Metagross. Love to see it. One. Three. Four. Five. Six. Whoa! What a play. What a play! I even overcharged a bunch. Should have thrown immediately. <laughs> oh, that's not good. That's not good. And I think I should have crunched here. No oh, issue, it's good. Oh, but I don't get to it. It's fine, I can farm down with Metagross, and this should only be a Drain Claw. Oh. Please be double steel. Three. All right, I mean, this is not ideal. It's definitely manageable. All right. No shield coming for the Gary. Just gonna shoot this move. Yeah, I think I'm. I think I'm fine here. Pretty sure I get to. Well, I'm not that sure, actually. Pretty sure I get to two moves versus Metacross, but I don't even have to. Hmm. I'm just gonna let this go to be safe. <sighs> Maybe that's a bad play. I'm gonna have to shield this. Yeah, and this, oh no, I should have just trusted it. I, because I, I'm pretty sure I could have gone into the Night Slash. Uh, over top, tap here. Aqua Tail won't be enough though. I can probably bullet punch this Gyarados down. Unless he has Crunch. Oh, there we go. All right, GG's. 3-2 already, 3-2. Ah, nice, 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 nice. That was really well played by my opponent, actually. Uh, now he gets a boost. Alright, that's fair. That's fair. Uh. That's only fair. Alright, 3-2. Three, 3-2. Two. Three, two. That's not bad. That probably puts, it, puts us in range of another 3-2. 606? Oh, no 606. Alright. That was a low, only 11 points, so I'm gonna need a 4-1. Pretty sure I'm gonna need a 4-1. So, uh, let's just get it. 5-0.
Epic Evan. Or first gatekeeper. At least she's gonna try. Magnezone. I like it. Right. Throw one Dragon Claw. Going to Gary. Um, this is might actually be a hurricane, but I'd be fine with it. I survive. Oh, it's got his freaking magnetism is gonna get so much energy though. So three. So much energy, that's not great. But usually these teams run with uh, Tokis in the back. Actually, Tokis or Gyarados. Since he shielded, I'm not expecting another steel in the back, actually. So it might be Tokis. Yeah, I was expecting it, so I didn't throw the counter. Man, that's good. I waited there because I was expecting that swap. If I would have thrown a counter there, Stokus would have killed my Hexorus. Hey, Jason, with the raid. I appreciate it, Jason. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for the good luck. How was your stream, man? How was your stream? Hope you had a, hope you had a good stream. For anyone tuning in, just now, I'm currently 2981. This is my last set, so I probably gotta go 4-1 uh, to get it. That's uh, three more wins. So, uh, yeah, let's see. Ooh, I played this guy earlier. And he had a very favorable lineup for me, pretty sure. I think Metagross? Yeah. What else was he running? I can't remember what else he was running, but I played him earlier for sure. You got a bu bullet punch through there, that's fine, as long as I get my counter through as well. Give me my counter during his bullet punch, during his meteor mesh. I'm just gonna throw the Night Slash because. He, like, I can burn a shield here or, or he dies. Yeah, that's alright. Fine. What did he have in the back? Oh, I can't remember what he had in the back. Oh wait, I do know what he had in the back. He had Swampert. He's running uh, uh, double water. I hope, I hope. <laughs> I hope I have the proper guy. If it's Tokish now, I'm gonna. <laughs> I'm not gonna be happy. Yeah, there we go. That's pretty lucky. I literally played this guy earlier tonight. <laughs> oh. Oh, my, maybe I should shoot that one. Probably should have shooted at one. <laughs> hmm. Let's 
I'm gonna go for the farm down because I don't want him to like be able to swap out. There we go, GG's. Could have had kept quiet about the rematch and played off like a hard read of his team. True. But I I like keeping it real out there. Yeah, the Hydro Cannon would not have KO'd. Uh, right, three more games. On a duo stream I played yeah, Friday, I faced the opponent twice, but when I watched the full pack, he played two different teams against me. Interesting, yeah. Some people uh, like swapping up the team a lot. It's actually pretty smart. Because especially at these higher ratings, some people like writing down teams. So, uh, it would be nice. Uh, it's nice to switch up your team sometimes to, uh, to throw those people off. Both yesterday and today I faced the same opponents in back-to-back -back sets. Wow. But you're quite, you're quite high rating, right? Damnation? So, that makes sense. Wow. <laughs> Rob, you can't get to rank 10 before me. We'll see, uh, Rob. We'll, we'll see. I hope I can, because I would really like to reach it tonight. How far away are you now, Rob? How far is us? Oh no. Freaking Hippo. Freaking Hippo. That's not great. Um, let's see, how do I play this? I mean, he, pro he definitely runs Hippo Hexorus. But the third can be anything. Just swap into this thing. Snorlax. It's not bad. It's not too bad. But if he's running the Hexorus, my Metacross might be in trouble. Is he gonna Skull Bash me? Please don't. Thank you. Good counting. Um, Alright, get to the awkward tail. He's probably gonna give up switch. He doesn't give up switch. I'm just gonna go into Metagross and farm. Yeah, I was expecting the instantaneous body slam, kinda. Oh, super power. Alright, good play. Staying in, that's nice. Oh, it's guard zone. Two, three, four. This is manageable. All right. Um. I think that's fine. I think that's fine. He is running the sand tomb. That's not great. But I think... Unless he has two body slams here. I don't think he's added yet. 
And that should only be one more bullet punch. First the guard chomp. There we go, GG's ninja. Woo! Man. Oh. GG's. Oh. That was nice. Alright. If anyone can uh, tell Ninja GG's for me, that would be uh, that would be great. Alright, 3-0 so far. I only need one more win. I, I really gotta pee. <laughs> I really gotta pee. I'll be right back. Was it CMP at the end? Oh, that's a sick game then. I'll be right back. Ah. Ooh, Kakaroto! Thank you, Nick. Alright, bring it. Kakaroto! Really good player from uh, Japan. Alright, I like this lead. Two, three, four, five, six. Amos Swine wins the zeros. Probably, uh, I always make this mistake. I should just Night Slash and get more farm, but this is still fine. Two, three, four. Interesting. Zone in the back? Maybe? Zone in the back would be awesome. I'd have to call some baits. Ooh, almost got to the night slash. This Metagross has a lot of farm. Yeah, this is not awesome, but... Hmm. This is gonna be tough. It's gonna be tough. Nice. Good, good, good. Can I get to this earthquake? Mirror shot, all right. Makes sense. Oh no. I could have gotten to an earthquake. But it was risky. Does she have two meter meshes? Won't be enough. Oh yes! That's a 4-1. What do you say, guys? We do the last battle with Ludicolo. We do the last battle with Ludicolo, alright? We do the last battle with Ludicolo. Wait, let me just uh, look something up real quick. Uh, alright. Uh, here we go. Alright. One second, one second. This should be it. Uh, I mean, I'm 4-0, right? Please update. All right, 4-0. Yeah, it should be enough. Should be enough. But let's let's do the final battle with Ludicolo. Uh, turn this song off. Let me just... Uh, let's see. I'll just use this same team with uh, Ludicolo instead of Hexorus. Yeah, should be fine. All right. Turn on the music. Oh yeah. Oh, Evan, bring it on, Evan. 
I was hoping to face a rank 9 actually. Woo, a lead! Ooh, a switching. Must say, I don't really enjoy this switching. It's gonna go into Ludicolo now. <laughs> Ooh, nice. Um. <laughs> All right, I'm just gonna sack this thing. I survive? I don't think I do. I think I barely do, actually. I do. Ludicolo. <laughs> Alright, go to meta. Should have waited out the clock. Should have waited out the clock. But I'm too... Too hyped to wait out to wait out the clock. Two, three, four, five. Go for the earthquake. Don't have much reason to bait here. Couldn't swap. That's fine. Please have, if you have Stokis in the back, that'd be quite nice. Alright. Get a little bit of chip. Farm down, Earthquake, the Magnazone. Are we gonna get a win? Oh, I need to put it, oh, oh, come on, again. I might be too low. I might be too low health. Don't boost? No, I think I think we got it. I think we got it actually. No boost, no boost, no boost, no boost, no boost, no boost. Come on, come on. Yes, all right. Come on. Come on. Come on, Metagross. Yes! <laughs> yes! Man! The 5-0! Boom! <laughs> no way! There's no way! <laughs> oh, that's too good! GG's! 5-0 to close it out. Is there any better way to close it out? Oh, oh my collection is full. Let's destroy some Murkrows. Bye. Oh, 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 oh. Give me a shiny dino. Ooh, Galarian Zigzagoon. This thing is rare, actually. This thing is pretty rare. Oh. I'm glad that... <laughs> I'm glad that was, uh, that was a rank 10 and not a rank 9, because... <laughs> I would have been. I would have felt real bad. Oh, this is a good one. Thank you for the bits, Doctor. All right. Let's see it. Let's see it. Oh, oh, oh yes. That's a nice rating. That's a nice rating. Oh, I'm so bad with the screenshot. That's a nice screenshot. We actually get the rewards. Oh, good.